tent in here. Looks like there's something behind that tunnel. So close oh, to drowning, maybe not not to the embers, M Moreland. It's over. Well, not for me. It's not. Then you're going to die alone, because we're not sticking around to fish out the corpse. We're through. And so the visionary's fate hung in the balance, would he choose life or succumb to deadly delusion? <clears throat> Hello. So, there's an ancient city under the sand, but it's flooded. Suddenly, a Nora spear maiden appeared. Yeah, okay, um... Well, you're not typical Delvers. That's for sure. What's this? Uh, I, I call it a diving bubble. This is the Mark I. The Mark II was better, but uh, it got stuck halfway down. Air tube snagged. You went down in that. Yeah, I hardly expect a lay person to understand. Because that's pretty smart. Uh, I'm sorry. May I remind you, you got stuck inside and nearly drowned. It'd have to be portable, though. Mm. Machine kneecap, maybe? Well, you'd need a filter. Synthetic membrane would do it. With a hose to a compressed, compressed air, air capsule. capsule. Hammer and tongs. What is this? What is happening here? What? Get over here. She's a stranger. You got a name? Aloy. Moreland. Not a stranger anymore. You're a damn fool. Come on. I got the original schematics over here. Oh, um... Well, hold on. Just a couple of questions first. Fair enough. Partner? Partner? Don't mind him. What's so important down there that you'd risk your life? Uh, uh well... <clears throat> Ah. Moreland, I'm not interested in salvage, okay? Whatever you find below is yours. Well, all right. Then what if I told you we were delving for the most spectacular treasures ever scribed by man or maid? I'd say get to the point. No nonsense. I like it. Behold, an ember. Looks like a piece of junk. Well, now, yes, but, 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 with the proper spark, these magnificent creations of the old ones paint mesmerizing pictures in the air, and the ruins below us are full of them. A feast for the eyes beyond description. This is my old Gramps promised me. I'd better get after those parts. There's a fully intact compressed air capsule in the Mark II, but like I said, it's stuck in the shaft. If you made it back up alive, I should be able to swim down that far. All right. As for the other parts, Stemmer Scout at a herd due south of here that should have what we need. I'm on it. Great. I'll come back when you get the gear. Good hunting. <laughs> According to Moreland, the herd should be south of here.
this is where Moreland said the herd would be. I must have moved on. I need to pick up that trail. Better look for tracks. I might trade for something good. Look around with my focus. There. Tracks should lead me to the herd. Storms blowing in. Just what I need. the herd. I should have the parts I need.
one synthetic membrane. Better check the other machines. takes care of the machine parts. Just gotta grab the compressed air capsule from Moreland's diving bubble. Should help. Finally, going to get away from this place. Well, good thing that Aloy showed up. We'll see. The longer their sojourn in the desert, the crustier the shard counter. Probably get at least three dozen. Are you budgeting? I won't. And you. It's going. <laughs> I'll leave. Do us. Leave us all. Air capsule. I should have all the parts to build this thing now. What can I do for you, partner? I've got everything I need to build the, uh, the incredible diving mask. I think diving mask is enough. I won't quibble. The workbench is all yours. Let me try it. There's a very special salvage I want down there. Assuming I don't drown. So what are you really looking for down there? It's hard to explain. Something that caused a malfunction in the apparatus that controls the old city. I think it started the flood. Well, I, I thought we started the flood. Like we sprung a trap. I don't know how we were detected. But suddenly, the dancing lights around us changed. Lights? What do you mean? Images in the air. Sparked by the embers, the salvage I'm after. Tiny hologram projectors? At first, there were lots of images. Women and, and coins and foodstuffs. And then, suddenly, they turned nautical. Waves fish. There was this flash of red and the roar of water surging in. Wait, a flash of red? A, a red light from a spot near the grate on the floor where the water burst through. It was like a beacon. For a warning. 
Thanks. That might help. I hope it does. And good luck down there. Okay. Time to see if this thing works. So far, so good. I can actually breathe down here. mask seems to be holding up. I've never been able to swim this deep before. Drainage controls offline. To execute an emergency purge, 
Manual reset of primary and secondary pump nodes is required. The purge can then be triggered at the pump maintenance station. If I do this purge and drain all the water, I can fight that big machine on dry ground. Looks like I have to reset a couple of pump nodes first. According to the map, there should be an access point for the first node south of here. the access point. Should lead me to the pump node. There must be a whole network of these tunnels down here. Water lines for an entire city. from here. Maybe something I can climb to get out. later. There. One node down. Better swim back up and find the access point for the second node. the map, the second node should be on the other side of the go. Whew. 
Well, that'll keep me awake. Maybe that debris is weighing it down. Okay, I've taken care of both nodes. Now I just need to activate the emergency code to the maintenance station. According to the map, the maintenance stations should be at the south end of the dome. Part of this building collapsed. There might be a way in. Possibly we'll eat right through that metal. There's red light in that tower. Just like at the console I found earlier. That might be the maintenance station. But how to get in? Okay, let's see where this leads. I think I'm in the maintenance station now. I just gotta find a console to activate the emergency purge.
That did it. <laughs> okay. Now I can deal with that machine guarding the door on the other end of the dome. And once I get past it, I can get to what's waiting on the other side of the door. I guess the push didn't get rid of all of the water. machines behind. Could sneak by them. I would have one first. Is this you? Did you lower the waters? Yeah, but there's a new problem. That thing's in our way. Wow. Yeah, it's gonna be difficult to get the embers with that around. If the scrappy band of adventurers beheld the beast, they knew what they had to do. What? Are you crazy? Hush now. She saved our death. Okay then. Stay up here and start firing when I engage.
gentlemen, get a move on. You guys all right? More than all right. This... you... we did it! <laughs> all the embers we could ever want, and it's all thanks to you. Very, uh, heartwarming. But maybe we can just, you know, grab what we came here for and get out before any more of those things decide to show up. Now, now, shard counter. Nothing wrong with a little reverend. Though we should probably let our flame-haired friend get going. I believe she has business down here, does she not? Right, of course. You need any help? I can handle it from here. Very well. well. We'll start taking some of the embers upstairs. Holler if you need us. Thanks. I'll save the extra stock for later. Poseidon should be somewhere beyond this door. Time to bring it home. Poseidon should be hiding in some kind of processor. I need to find a console to gain access to it. There. I should be able to use that, that console. I'm here to bring you home, Poseidon. To Gaia. Elizabeth Sobek. Alpha Prime. Restoring Poseidon's subordinate function to original code. Bring this back to Gaia. System reboot initiated. Looks like taking Poseidon triggered a restart of the city's power system. Moron and crew must have headed back up top. With all the windows they could carry with us. Must have built this before the place flooded. Nice to work. Be nice not to have to climb back up.
Whatever she did, it must have powered up the whole city. Is that? <laughs> oh. oh, the show my old gramps always wanted. There's another. His dream realized. His old Gramps' legacy ensured. Our hero beheld the sea of desert lights and wept at his good fortune. When I saw the embers as a child, I never dreamed they could be like this. Thank you, Aloy. Well, did you find what you were looking for? I did. And now I have to move on. Oh. Oh. Come back when you can. I got big plans for this place. I thought you wanted to put on shows with the Embers back in the claim. Oh, no. <laughs> this is the show. Oh, can you imagine? Folks from all over the land coming to take it all in. Plus, some food and a nice place to stay. Not to mention a variety of entertainment venues. Uh, don't forget, games of chance. Plenty of shards to be had there for certain. <laughs> a new dream, huh? I, um, I hope you make it happen. Goodbye, gentlemen. This delve is a story for the ages. All thanks to you. If Moreland and crew is gonna stay, maybe I should come back and check on them later. For now, I need to get Poseidon back to Gaia. But with all the ruins here, I might want to look around before I head back. Welcome back, Aloy. I see you have recovered Poseidon. Aloy, can you come downstairs? Beta has something you need to hear. His little big man. She found that recording from the data on your focus. She's been watching it a lot. I think it helps calm her. You know, I used to watch this a lot too. Whenever I wanted to take my mind off things. Daddy sure does love his little big. But there's something you need to tell me. While you were gone, I came down here to check on her. Then we started talking. Right, Beta? She's been thinking about how to capture Hephaestus, studying the data Gaia gave her. But we started talking about some other stuff. You know, just getting to know each other, right? And then she told me that one of the Zeniths might be different from the others. Tilda. You saw her at the Hades Proving Lab. Go on. On the way to Earth, the Zeniths never showed their faces. My servitor caretaker referred to them as my benefactors and brothers.
promised I'd meet them someday, when I had learned enough. And then, one day, a data channel opened in my training interface. In it, Tilda was waiting for me, in a virtual replica of a house on a cliff overlooking the ocean. It was beautiful. She showed me paintings, books, media files. We met there in secret many times. But a few months later, it stopped. Can you tell us why, Beta? I found some data about Tilda at the Hades Proving Lab. I think she was a liaison between Far Zenith and Zero Dawn. She knew Elizabeth Sobek, that's for sure. Maybe that's why she reached out to you? So Tilda set up a secret virtual space where she could talk to you, a house on a cliff. Then later, she cut you off. But other than the fact that Tilda knew Elizabeth, you don't know why she did those things? I don't! Okay? I thought of every possible reason that would make her leave, but whatever I did wrong, I don't know what it is! When I finally met the others, she ignored me. I acted like the data channel never existed. None of this even matters. Tilda's the same as the others. It won't help us defeat them. Okay. Let's leave it at that, then. What's wrong? I'm trying, Varl. But she is tough to take. I'm out there in the wilds, risking my life every day, and all she can do is hide in there and tell us how hopeless it all is. I'm sorry, she's had a rough time, but she is really not helping right now. Hmm. You always seem to be on top of everything, so I sometimes forget about what you've been through. I mean... It wasn't that long ago you were so banged up you couldn't even walk. About that. When I pulled you out of the water back near the Proving Lab, you were muttering Rost's name. You never talk about him. But he raised you. Trained you. You must miss him a lot. Of course I do. But I don't have time to think about that now. I need to get back out there. Okay. I'll keep working with Beta. Gaia says she knows a lot about Zero Dawn. And maybe she just needs some time to adjust, and then she can help us with Hephaestus. Sure. But I won't hold my breath. <laughs>